now we're recording too. So speaking of which, uh, I know the VODs have not been uploaded in a while. I'm sorry about that. Those will get uploaded to the YouTube channel um, kind of soon. Um, I'd honestly just forgot about uploading them. So those will get uploaded one way or another. So that way you guys can view them later on, should you wish. Oh, cool. So I don't remember what's going on, actually. I, I, I seem to remember that we're kind of in need of um, going after Abby. I think that's what we're supposed to be doing. It's hard for me to say for sure if, like, we're just doing some shit right now. I don't know. Dude, I'm getting messages right now. This kind of blows. Hello? Oh, look at this. It's the whole journal. Okay. Let's take a look at this. I'm not going to read this whole thing out loud. I'm just skimming through it real quick. Like she's writing a poem of some kind here. Kind of interesting. She like in boxers. I think that's what those are, dude. You could like see those cheeks. Yo. <laughs> um. Yeah, it looks like she's just like in some boxers or something. There's. Is that a lamp? It is. We can't do anything with it. Uh. Exit out here? No, because you're wearing underwear. Probably not a wise idea. Yeah, burr. Ooh, are we going to play the guitar again? Also, check this out. I have an entire mason jar. You can't really... It looks like a jar of shit, but it's not. It's full of chocolate. Just like a bunch of chocolate. There we go. That looks a little better. Um, I went and bought some chocolate and filled up a mason jar with it. Gee, thank you, dude. Thanks for rubbing it in. It is the shit jar. I don't immediately recognize the song she's playing. Why? I woke up in the morning about half past nine. The hacks in the bug is standing on the line. Jensen gave her a stinger around. Taking little city to the bed. Another flashback. I hate these things. Tell me about it. Your old man really laid into me today. This is the new meme, me and Anna on a shit jar. What happened? Another big lecture about my patrols. Don't go here, don't go there. It's funny how involved you time. your schedule to go out. Yeah. She's, uh, she's put on quite the show. I give you guys two weeks until you're back together. Not gonna happen. She, uh, Say something to you. Make it one week. Ellie! Hey! 
took you so long? Well, I'm here, aren't I? Fina? Jesse? Come on. Hey, don't forget, we're heading out early, so get some rest. Yes, sir. Every time I lose, I eat out of the shit jar. Dude, I'm gonna like be puking me? out chocolate ice cream. Not okay, I'm gonna be pooping out chocolate ice cream. For you. How bad do I smell? Like a hot pile of garbage. Oh, okay. I'm trying to figure out what's oh. going on. How about that? Gross. <laughs> you love it. Every guy in this room is staring at you right now. Maybe they're staring at you. <laughs> Welcome, Chase. Not. Maybe they're jealous of you. In case you're wondering, he was telling me to go play another game, and then every um, time I lose, I eat out of the chocolate jar, which girl. coincidentally looks a little bit like a no, shit jar right. from a distance. And he told, and I'd probably, I was just saying that, like, I would probably end up shitting out chocolate ice cream at that point. Oh, Ellie. I think they should be terrified. For real though, this jar, I mean, this is a big mason jar. Hey. Just for reference, you know, right next it's to my head. Event. Of course you can't see it because of the, here, like this. Sorry. This is a big jar. Sorry. Remember next time there's kids around. <laughs> yeah, like you're setting such a great example. Oh, just what this town needs. Another loudmouth dyke. The fuck did you just say? Ellie, hey. Ellie, don't. Get the hell out of here. Get your hands off me. Hey! Enough. Come on, you. Let's go for a walk. What about them? You worry about yourself. Let's get you some fresh air. You all right, kiddo? What is wrong with you? He had no right. And you do? I don't need your fucking help, Joel. Ooh. He's just trying to help, Ellie. Come on. Right. Joel's just trying to be the good guy. Don't do this. I'm gonna readjust my seat. Hold on. Ow. Oh, there we go. Sitting crisscross applesauce in my office chair. <laughs> Which is oddly very comfortable. Uh oh. Hey. I'm not a huge fan of her new haircut. Hey. Man, it's been a while since he slept this long, huh? He had a day. Yeah. He's fine. Go back to bed. Talk about it in the morning, okay? I have to finish it. Hmm. You don't owe Tommy anything. I don't sleep. I don't eat. I'm, I'm not like you, Dina. What? You think this is easy? For you and for him, I deal with it. I love you. Prove it. Stay. Ooh, she's putting the pressure on her now. I can't. So what? I'm just supposed to, to sit here and wait for you? For God knows how long, just thinking you're fucking dead the entire time? I don't plan on dying. Yeah, well, neither did Jesse. Or Joel. Hey, stop. Hey. Hey. Come on. We've got a family. She doesn't get to be more important than that. Hmm. 
No. I'd like to start shooting up some zombies now, please. I'm not going to do this again. Well, so from what I've been told, we're rocking about another four and a half to five hours of gameplay left. So we're getting pretty close to the end of the game from what I understand. Kind of hard to believe the game is as long as it is. Straight a week ago. Are we really just gonna play for this. as Abby again? Delete. No way that guy saw fireflies over here. Stop. I feel good about this. Well, I don't. Come on. We're just gonna play as Abby again. Gosh dang it. Ah, I wanna play as Ellie. It's not going to be on that side. It's all evens. This really is sad. Something's up there. Uh. game is just so violent. All right. We're good. I don't know if I should be like checking out all these houses. It feels kind of unnecessary at this point. I guess I'll kind of at least briefly look at all of them. I see something here that we can open. Or, oh, oh no. Graffiti. Just like graffiti. Does that mean fireflies? No. No, the fireflies had at least. a very unique logo. Oh, wait, hold on. Here's something we can check out here. Clicker. Yep. God, I hate clickers so much. So here's what I'm thinking. Did that work? You dead? Okay, you're dead. Good. Was that really worth it though? Got some tape. Keep your guard up. Let's go back to finding that house. Guess that's something. That a boy. 2425. Well, let's move on. So it's going to be on the right side, apparently. Like a house that we maybe can get into. Or not. I don't see any numbers. Yeah. Let's see. Might work, though. Let's see here. So there's...
still these upgrade paths, but no journal or anything. I kind of hate that we're still playing as Abby, honestly. Like, I felt like they should have advertised that she was going to be a playable character a little bit more, honestly. But that's just me. Searching. And it does look abandoned. Oh, of course. Maybe there's another way in. Everything Are always locked. I'm trying to be helpful. You're always helpful. Hmm. This is 2425. Maybe there's a window? Aha! Da, da, da. Nada. Is it really nothing? It can't be. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, okay, now I have this open. I feel like there's got to be something in that shed. That seems like a good spot for there to be something. What about... I mean, there's stuff in here. It's not entirely useless. I guess. But I'd go so far as to say as we really didn't get anything out of this. Lev, I think we're done here. No, wait. You find something? Oh. Scratches. <laughs> this thing has been pushed. Scooch. Howdy, welcome. How's it going, Hunter? Or Catfish2411. <laughs> Whichever you prefer to be called. We're playing a rather violent game right now, even though it doesn't look like it. Hello? Oh, well, sure enough, this looks like a place where there's probably a good number of people hitting well. Doing well, just vibing? Heck yeah, brother, vibe away. It's been a while since anyone's been here. Unfortunately, I have to agree with you. Hey, what's going on over here? Quit giving me empty drawers, gosh dang it. Pretty nice barracks, all things considered. Yeah, I mean, this actually doesn't look half bad. For whatever it is, I guess. What can we craft? This is Minecraft. Give me that. Uh, let's see. Here? Nope. What about here? They had power down here. Look around. Well, if they had power, it probably came from this thing. Guess they've got solar. Oh. This is cool. Is this frequency currently in use? This is... Do you see a call sign anywhere? Oh, a what? It's a short list of numbers and letters. Hmm. This is Abby from Santa Barbara. Can anyone hear me? Standing by. Is anyone out there? What's this? That would be some call signs. Those are frequencies. Oh, you know, they're frequencies. Oh, okay. Is this frequency currently in use? This is Abby from Santa Barbara. Is anyone out there? Are these other Firefly outposts? I don't know. Can anyone hear me? Hello? Is this frequency currently in use? This is Abby from Santa Barbara. Hello? Hello?
We're just gonna try all of them, aren't we? Is this frequency currently in use? Hello, this is Abby from Santa Barbara. Can anyone hear me? If anyone can hear me, please reply. Ugh. Please answer. Not a good All sign. Right. We got a clear signal on you. Where in Santa Barbara are you calling from? Um, 24, 25 Constance. Uh, we got a tip about a base, but there's no one here. We're looking for fireflies. I'm a, I'm a firefly. Where were you stationed? I was part of the Salt Lake outpost. Who ran that facility? Dr. Jerry Anderson. He was my dad. Well, how about that? Hmm. We pulled everyone back from the satellite stations and brought them back here to home base. How many of you are there? More about 200 strong now, with a few more every month. Oh, that's right. I just brought a chocolate get two more. by my mom. How do we find you? Get to Catalina Island. Approach the large domed building in Avalon. We'll find you. Okay. Okay, we'll see you soon. Over and out. Looking forward to it. Good luck, Abby from Santa Barbara. Over and out. Well, Come on, let's get back to the that might be a little bit of just luck. Okay, fine. You were right. Uh, what was that? Why do you make me repeat whenever I'm wrong? Because it makes me feel better. <laughs> sure. It happens so rarely. Um, okay, where did we come in from? We came in from the back side, didn't we? No, actually, hold on. Oh, it was the garage. Hey, this way. Oh? Lead the way, Lev. Or not. Okay. I thought you were gonna lead the way, stupid dude. Um... Okay, seriously, where did we come in from? Am I, like, suffering from the major stupid right now? Wait, hold on, there's something here. Never mind, it's an empty drawer. Why are you doing this to me? Here we are. Oh my lord! Oh my god. I'm feeling now. Tyra. Come here, let me see you. You ready? Wait, what are you doing? Wait, wait. Fuck, man. You're fine. I mean, You're ow. Done. Don't you fucking touch him! Oh, that for sure would kill him. Oh, shit. What the hell what is going on? Nothing in this game is coherent. Some, well, sometimes. And are we playing as Ellie now? Of all the people to know that as a fact, Catfish, you definitely would know that. Where did you go from here? Too 
four two five constants. Yeah, that's gotta be it. We're finally playing as Ellie again. It feels so good. Proper main character on our hands. How would she get up to the street from here? I mean, I see a very visible way how she got up to the street from here. I don't think it's that hard to tell. Now, what kind of weapons are we rocking here? We're rocking the bow, shotgun, and our normal pistols, it looks like. Yeah. Just the magnum. In Cadaver Lab. That's pretty fun. Here, we'll switch to shot. Actually, nah, we'll go to our pistol, but we'll just remove the silencer. For now. We hop up here? Nope. Can we hop up here? Yes, we can. Uh. Oh, and jump. Yeah, one more time. There we go. <laughs> Oops. Uh, oh, hello, dead body. With a gun. For some reason, I don't know why, but for some reason that made me think of one of my favorite uh, old YouTube videos. It's not even that old, it's, I don't know, maybe like a year old now. And it's uh, this edit of uh, the one episode where Patrick wants an award. Um, but he can't figure out how to get an award, and Spongebob has to help him by opening a pickle jar. Well, normally there's a point where... Um, Spongebob was like, all right, now grab a jar, and Patrick's supposed to pick up a pickle, but instead somebody edited it so it looked like he has a gun, and then they also edited Spongebob's voice to make it sound like, Patrick, that's a gun. And he's like, yes, and then it it goes to like a dark, crusty crab oh, that no. looks like he's getting shot up with him, with both of them screaming. <laughs> and I know it's not, I mean, it's, it's really awful, but it's really funny, actually. Okay. If I can, I'll drop that in the memes chat on my Discord. Um, I guess this must be the right way. Quit jumping. All right, what are we rocking here? Now what? I don't know. You tell me. Bluff. I'm here. And Santa Barbara proper is that way. Ah, yes, uh, we do have a Discord. If you want to join it, there's a link down way below. You can join it and come be a part of the, uh, the penal kingdom, as we call it. Something to that effect. Uh, I think I see a zombie. Yep. And some clickers. Really cool. Alright. So I heard a clicker. So you know that's a good sign. Because you know we're going the right way at that point. Okay. So there's clickers, and then there's these just awful creatures. Nope, we're running. Book it, book it, book it. Shit. Oh no 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 This game is so tense, I swear. Nothing about this game is easy. Everything has to be hard. <laughs> Hello. Ooh, I actually dodged it. Ow. Oh, ow, come on. Nope, get out of the way. Get out, get out, get out.
I think it worked. <laughs> I think it worked. That is true. We do mostly just make fun of me. You're about 100% right on that one. Alright, I think I'm done. Yeah, it looks like I'm done. Alright, let's move forward. Um... I feel like we need to get through there. But. Ah, I see how. Boy, that's like bare naked ass right there. Gotcha. Wait, why'd you why'd you enable emote only chat? Okay, good, you disabled it. Um, although emo only chat might be fun for a minute. Hope I can cut through here. Just assuming there's not like a shitload of zombies everywhere. Um, I'll take that. Take that, take that, take that. Hey, can I get an upgrade? Um, 50% mover speed, movement speed, oops. You won the lottery and got a gift sub? Very nice. I got one on a smaller YouTube, or not YouTube, uh, streaming channel a while back. It was, I uh, can't remember her name now. Lily Vanilli or something like that. Alright. Alright. Oh, cool. There's two of them. Even better. Ow. That probably was not worth it. Dude, hit me up with the emotes. Hold on. Ow. Yeah, shamblers really suck. Yeah, that sucks. That hurts a lot. Get me out. Oh my god, it's a clicker. No, it's not. It's just another one of these attacks. You know what? Basically a clicker. God damn it. Alright, uh, I'm gonna call that dumb, though, because I probably could have avoided that a number of ways. All right, hold on. Let's sit up so we can freeze. Gotcha. Let's go, chat. Do this. Fuck. Get right on through here. Dude, those are some actually some pretty dope looking emotes. I like the Luigi emote a lot. I 
think I somehow managed to avoid it. Santa Barbara's downhill. 24, 25 constants. 24, 25 constants. Let's go. First, give me all the goods. Yeah, so if I ever get enough subscribers to make it worth it, well, I'm sorry, enough followers to make it worth it and I actually can, like, set up paid subscriptions on here, I will pay somebody from, like, Fiverr or whatever to, um, to do some artwork for me to make some custom emojis or something. I was actually thinking about paying somebody on Fiverr to make some custom channel artwork for me, but Fiverr can get a little pricey, unbelievably. to be killing Hmm. You're kind of stuck down there. Dude, it's penal poggers time, chat. Go. All right, well, that worked actually surprisingly well. All things considered. Uh, ooh, crap. We're gone bad. This definitely looks like California. Like, I'm definitely getting strong California vibes from this. Oh, crap. He would die from this. She lasts a month. Uh, can we please just say we're done for the day? Yeah. yeah get that thing down. Let's reset the trash. Really, man? I mean, is she even worth the trip back? It's not like. Ah, ah, fuck! Oh, hey, get you! Uh, no, 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 no. I'm good. Oh. <laughs> Something funny? Like you shit your pants. Fuck you say. Oh, little bitch. <laughs> oh, you, you like funny, huh? Get up. Yeah. Come on. Get up. We don't need no, this. No, man, she's fucked up anyway, man. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. Yeah, it's funny, right? Stop. It's funny. Seriously. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, that's pretty accurate. Yeah, that's her. You let me go. I'll tell you where she is. You can get to her before that infection takes over. Talk. She's in a holding cell at our camp. Where is that? Head that way till you hit the railroad track. 
That'll lead you to a resort. We keep them in the tall, round building. I swear. At least this is, like, pretty interesting. Oh my gosh. He needs to get bandaged up bad. Like, so many of the injuries that she's experienced in this game should have straight up just offed her. Like, she should Extra not be sword. surviving. Tall round building. Tracks to resort. Tall round building. Hey, she stitched it herself. <laughs> Well, I'll be darned. I mean, yeah, that probably hurt like crap. Hey, we'll go back. Is that a gun? He's got we'll a gun! Go back. God damn it. Shit. All right. Fuck did he get a gun? Tell the others to search the area. Make sure he's the only one that got a gun. Oh, God. Stray! Okay. Hold on. Oh, ho, ho. that's sad. I don't think you would ever actually be able to get a machine gun like this. That's like this silent. I better find her before these idiots kill her. Like, now we're being introduced to a third group of just random people. The assault rifle is overpowered, and it's like a silenced assault rifle, too. I mean, that's, like, insane. Or at least I think it sounds. It certainly sounds silenced. I mean, good lord. To be fair, you got an assault rifle, like, in the very end of the first game. Like, in the last 15 minutes of the first game, actually. I mean, like, it kind of looks like this this section of the game is getting ready to get pretty intense. I wonder if we're going to kill Abby. Actually, as a matter of fact, everybody, write your predictions. I'm, like, pretty confident we're going to end up killing Abby. I don't know. Like, literally, you got an assault rifle, like, at the very, very end of the first game. For reasons I don't know. It was very stupid, in my opinion, anyway. Uh, let's cr Oh, we can't. Oh, because we already... Oh, it crafts two at a time. Uh, you don't think Abby will die? Do you think Ellie's gonna die? Because I feel like we're gonna lose a main character. I feel like that's sort of guaranteed. You don't think Ellie's gonna die? I mean, I guess we'll see what happens. Anything's possible. This is a big area. Goodness. But for good reason. We have a kind of a large group of people here. Yeah, I mean, I feel like Ellie's gonna end up dead at the end of this game. I think some jack wagon is gonna finally kill her. There is a lot of people here. Fucking ambush! Think it came from back there! Someone's out there. 
Alright, hold on. Nope, nope, nope. Okay, I didn't do this well. Over here! Ow, ow. Why are they called rattlers? Okay, we're dead. That was actually very stupid. I really should have thought about how to do this more. Um, okay. Let's adjust this to 23. Again. Yes, that was a big fat F indeed. Um, so if we play our cards right... Man, there are so many people here. The problem is a bunch of them are wearing headgear, so you can't shoot them in the head. Which actually makes this area, like, a little bit trickier than the past areas have been. Get her back here. I don't think you know it. I think we're gonna take you big time. Because that's one. Okie dokie. Now. Ah, uh, we don't have tape. I guess we'll see what happens at the end of the game, but I kind of, I kind of have to wonder if they're getting ready to announce like, like a Last of Us Part Three kind of shit. Because I remember at the end of Final Fantasy XIII too, which was, by the way, great RPG. I highly recommend that you play Final Fantasy XIII too if you ever get the chance. Like, they straight up were ready to announce the third game. And they did. They said to be continued at the end. Like, I'm mildly worried they're gonna pull some kind of shit like that, or they're gonna almost worse than that announce a DLC. Like, some really big story DLC that's gonna cost like 30 bucks or something like that. That would actually annoy the crap out of me. Okay. <laughs> Okay, we actually got pretty lucky there. I, yeah, they're aware we're here. Yeah. I'm not gonna be too shocked if they announce a DLC for this game. I kind of hope I they don't, but... Around somewhere. Yeah, I can probably get behind this woman. Huh? Nope. Oh. I'm just gonna do that. Next. Okay, I think we did it. That went very well, actually. Let's check out. Oop. Fuck. Keep hitting the microphone. Well, yeah, I mean, it, you got the tracks? hit pretty hard there. Yeah, I know. I'm looking for the tracks, but I'm also looking for, like, secrets and stuff like that. I want to see if I can find anything else. Did we already check out over there? Old bridge over there. But it might be blocked off. It looks like it might be blocked off. Yeah, that looks blocked off to me. Okay. I still think this game might take okay. the cake for, like, the absolute the most violent, like, game I've played that has this good of a story. The story's still not great, but it is pretty good, all things considered. Yeah, I mean, this this straight up looks like California. Like, it's, it's kind of bizarre how California-esque this looks. I mean, I've never been to California, but I've seen an awful lot of, like, pictures of California. And, like, this just has that look.
Oh. Oh my god. Let's move. Oh god. That looks like a tall round building. Yeah, that looks like a tall round building. I don't know, you tell me how we get in there. See some ammo though, which is probably wise for me to pick up. Actually, no, this isn't ammo. Just crafting supplies. Not even enough to craft something. Ooh, and a letter. Hey Rattlers, it's Mackenzie. I'm out. Free. My husband died picking your t fucking tomatoes. We aren't some lonely stragglers. I will be back with others. Your time is coming. Ooh. So, vengeance. Well, don't worry. Vengeance is coming in one way or another. In this case, it's through a lesbian. Okay, so we can't walk through that plant. Very cool. How do we get over here? Um... Aha! Uh -huh. There we are. Hello. Whoa. Very nice to meet you, Ellie. Yeah, I bet your side still hurts like a bitch, doesn't it? Come on, come on, you can do it. Just a little closer, buddy. Do leave him alone. Fuck that. I promised him I'd do this to him. <gasps> this is Bet you wish you didn't try to escape now, don't you, Anthony? Hold on, I'm gonna do it. Search this place. Someone must have slipped past us. Got that right, bub. Goodness. Think you're dead. Holy crap. Alright, give me that. Oh, there's more around here? Oh yeah, sure enough. Okay. Coward. I don't know, man. Bitch. Right. Okie Let's get some upgrades going. People, upgrades, people, upgrades. Um, These are some sick fucks. Can we actually do anything here? Fire rate? Sure. I'll take it. Do it, boys. Um. Oh, hold on. I definitely am gonna want assault rifle ammo. I don't think that's a negotiable thing. I think this weapon is gonna end up becoming our best friend very quickly. Any and all assault rifle ammo I can get my hands on is probably for the best. Here. Crafting materials definitely aren't bad either. Neither, neither is shotgun ammo. Um, take that, thank you. So you couldn't have just opened the shower door? <laughs> you just have to smash everything open, Ellie? 
game is violent. I love it though. Um, thank you. And thank you. Thank you. Forward. Okay. Seems like a very good area just to get completely ambushed. Do I want followers only chat? Nah. Nah, I kind of want other people to be able to join. I knew that was a thing. If I ever get subscribers, maybe I'll consider doing like subscriber chats or something like that because that could potentially be kind of fun. Um. Craft one of these. We can craft one of these. We can craft one of these and one of these. We're actually kind of loaded right now, which is a little rare. I normally never have this much stuff on me. Um, what else can we craft? Craft one of these. And I'm actually going to equip the bow. And I'm going to swap ammo to this, I guess, explosive? Actually, no. We should probably go to go with the regular if we're wanting to be stealthy at all about this. Uh, guess nothing over here. Hop through here, though. That looks like it. Another ambush. Hold on, boy. I'm coming for you. Gotcha. Alright, I'm gonna release this dude. Really? Shit. I wasted three ammo for that. That fuck face over there. Okay. That's appreciated. Whoa! She's running! There, there! God damn it! Ow. Hold on. She's Shit. out! Murder! Move up! All right! Shit. Ow. Shit. I got overwhelmed there. I thought I had a better grasp on that. Oh, so I'm getting like a hundred thousand text messages. Hold on. I don't know who's trying to talk to me because nobody talks to me. Hey, welcome to the Discord, by the way. Um uh, at Hunter. Much appreciate. Um So like I think I have the right approach. Run away. Or not. Over here. Go around. Ah, shit. Come on. Get him. Nope. Get away. Get. Okay. Nope. This is this is a bad time. Yep. This is a bad time. I'm gonna heal. Fuck. Oh, 
shit. Nope, hit him. Alright, so much for being sneaky. We're just we're just gonna go for it. There's really no point in being discreet here. There's still four, I think. Yeah, there's one more. We're getting killed. Oh. <laughs> God. Wait, is there really more? Well, there's the zombies, although I really am not that threatened by the zombies that are tied up. I'm more threatened by everything else. What the Craft one of these dudes. Come on, come on, don't do anything stupid. I really cannot tell you for a fact who's shooting me. Yeah, I see you. Ow. Okay, fine. We're just going to do this fashion way. Nope. You're getting it. Don't let her get away. Oh my gosh. After all of that, I get killed. No. I'll have to redo this whole thing. Oof. Okay, we're gonna try the stealth approach again. Shit. Okay, good. That, that worked pretty well. Might be someone here. I got it. Infected got loose! Shit! You know, the infected getting loose is actually an extremely fun way of just screwing this entire operation up for them. I mean, this is pretty great. We got a Push it! <laughs> Violence in this game is just so unreal. I'm on. All right, let's see. Ow. Ow. I got her.
Hold on. Where'd you go? I'm sure you are. Asshole. Ow. Ow, I'm gonna die. Yep. Alright, this one is gonna require a little bit more thought. Um... Well, let's see here. I really have never been good at strategy games. So, this is a very different sort of experience for me. Get up, Ellie. Screwed this up again, but whatever. Circle behind her. Yeah, on it. We've got her over here. Gotcha. Get him, please. This is why I use class... Or is that why you use class mode and fire emblem? I mean... I just suck at video games. I, I go with the generally... Whatever the easiest mode is in all situations. Well, not easiest, but... Sometimes the easiest. Right there! So I hear more people, but I also. Oh my lord! Gotcha. All right, we're going shotgun. Oh my gosh. Forty four. All right, this one is proving to be the most difficult sort of attack we've had so far. What did I say? I don't know what you're referencing. I suck at video games. I generally go with, like, the easiest mode on things that I can, or usually easiest mode I can. Hold on. We're stealthing. We're just gonna stealth this shit. Pure stealth it. We're gonna do what we can. Like, there's this dude here. Which, like, if we can stealth this guy, then we probably are gonna be okay to release this guy. Come on, get back here, get back here, get back here. Good. Um, get that. Craft me this. And, uh, that. Okay, so now I'm gonna go down here and I'm gonna release this zombie. I 
I prefer to enjoy my video games rather than just play video games for the sake of just playing them because they're hard. Like, I've beaten Bloodborne. I haven't been able to ble uh, defeat Sekiro. I've gotten pretty close to defeating uh, Dark Souls, but never beat that game. Like, games that are just, like, deliberately very difficult have just never been my forte. I'm unapologetic about not beating them on the hardest difficulty, if I can. Alright. This is probably the right approach, honestly. Really? Gotcha. So I definitely think releasing the uh, the wave of zombies on them is the right idea. Oh, it's saved. Wait, where did it save? Oh, okay. Okay. Let's try this again. Let me go. You run away. Oh, sure. Right over here. God damn. Okay. I don't actually know how many people have seen me. Fuck the shit. I don't know how I got the attention of him, but whatever. Now I gotta go release these assholes over here. Whether or not that was the right call, I don't know. We're gonna find out, though. kidding me this is seriously like definitely the most difficult like ambush type of fight i've had so far thought i 
I saw someone. I'll see what's up. I got you covered. Don't. Okay. All right, so one mistake I think I made not switching my weapon immediately to the we shotgun. Right here! Yep, another F. I didn't say I was good at this game. Trying to figure out where they are. Down. Ow. Alright, I don't know who's shooting me, but I'm just gonna get away. Actually, no, we're gonna change the assault rifle out for this thing. We need to start sniping some of these guys. Wherever we can find them, that is. Well, I know this dude probably can hear me. I'm gonna go ahead and free this infected. That was actually, in the green scheme of things, a very bad idea. Dude, she's like hanging on a limb right there. Nowhere to be found for now. Who the heck saw me? I'm going to release the clickers because they don't know I'm here. They weren't supposed to know I was here. Are you kidding me? Everything about this just has to be difficult. So the game gave me a graceful save point here. Checkpoint, whatever you might want to call it. It's not worth it to try and get the uh, the clickers, I don't think. So, screw it. We're not going to. Um, instead, we're just going to see if we can get the sneak on any of these guys. There's a lot of them over here. I think I saw someone. I'll go check it out. Are you actually good, though? I don't know what the music is. I'm trying to figure it out. Um. Definitely not a fan of the current situation. We got a live one! No, we definitely want this. Ow. 
Ow. Hold on. Okay. This one might finally be it. I don't know if I got everybody, and nor do I care. I want to get out of here as soon as possible at this point. Just get me as many crafting materials as I can so I can make a I don't know, health kit or something and just let me go. That'll work instead. We can make a craft, or we can craft a health kit, good lord. I can't speak. <laughs> Um, all right, let's see what kind of crap we can find in here. That's very nice. Um, attach our silencer back, just in case we run into any more people. Ooh, all this ammo, very nice. Let's, uh, re-equip this. So, okay, good number of people upstairs. In here! Ow, fuck me. <laughs> Shit, yeah. oh, come on, you're not getting me. Never mind, you got me. I'm gonna call that a very stupid death because I keep getting over ambitious. Okie dokie. Yep, so it's largely just people upstairs. Yep. So I, sh I was too ambitious there in trying to get the headshot. Gotcha. It came from that way. We got it. Gotcha. Again. Just for shits and giggles. Pop your face out again, dude. Alright, good stuff. Oh, fuck. Anybody else? That I think was it. I think I finally got it. Oh boy, this is a stressful game. Like taking years off my life. Hold on, my watch is sliding up my arm. There we go. What do we got here? Jenny sending along some extra beef, grapefruit, and potatoes. I just got. They've been impressed with how many strays I've captured and wanted to reward me. We're seeing the best crop we've had since they settled here. Please make sure my mom gets fatty cuts. She looked too skinny last time I saw her. Pat. Keep hearing the music, so... We're getting pretty close to the source of the music. Best for now. Man, this place is loaded with supplies. It's uh, pretty nice, actually. Thank you. Uh, 
I check out all this? I might have already seen all this. I think I already saw all this. I think I must be done because Abby's moving slower. So. Of course. that. Anything else? You. Uh, so much for the stealth approach there. Hey, this actually kind of sucks. Like, this is definitely the hardest part of the game. And, like, it's straight up not that enjoyable. Come on, get her. Come on, hit me up with that reload. Assault rifle, baby. Ow. Oh shit, of course I'm out of... On, I need shotgun ammo so bad. That's the only way I'm surviving this. Oh, We're getting there. You're not wrong about that. Okay, cool. Shotgun. That's been by far the most useful weapon in all this crap. Which is a little shocking. I would have expected the assault rifle to be a little bit better. But it honestly is proven to not be that useful. At least not right now. See anything else, so... I guess we must be good for now. Can I craft any more... I need more paper. Oh, I hope we'll run into more paper. Actually looks pretty fun, though. I'm kind of worried we're about to get to a huge ambush, though. Reload our assault rifle and hope we don't die. Interesting. Wait. Where we go? Yeah, this is where we go. Ow. She's bit! Keep back! Hey, don't put that fucking thing in hey, me! Hey, 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 hey! 
Abby tried to escape. She's down in the pillars. The pillars? Head down to the beach. You won't miss it. She's probably already dead. Come on! I thought they were gonna help us there. That would've been nice to know. It's like, okay, yeah. Ellie's bit, but... That's really not the biggest point of concern here. She's immune anyway. Oh shit, I can't, like, craft anything. I can't reload my gun. I don't like the look of this. I think... I think we're about to see some shit happen here. Guys, this is not a great situation. Oh my god, they've set the building on fire. We're moving so slow. I feel like we must be approaching to the end of the game. Like, we've got to be getting close. Like, this feels way too cinematic for it to not be the end of the game. Oh my god. Abby? That's Abby right there, I think. No, looks a lot like her, though. Oh, nope, okay. Um... Oh, shit, that's Abby. Cut her hair. It's you. Boy, she lost a lot of weight. Oh, that's lead. Abby. I got you. I don't know if Abby's okay, but she looks bad. I mean, she is. Please don't make me kill Abby now. Like, that would just be awful. Come on, you can do it. Boy, we're moving really slowly. Like, I can't do anything about how slow we're currently moving. The boat.
So I'm guessing Ellie's just gonna let her go. And Ellie does not look good either. I mean, both of them look bad. This is looking rough. I mean, I think she's... She's bleeding again, isn't she? Oh my god. No, come on. Don't make me kill her. I can't let you leave. doing this. That's a way to get her attention. Part of this. You made him a part of this. Go. 
Just take him. I mean, ow, that finger. I mean, come on. I find this unbelievable that Ellie or Abby would have lived this long in that kind of fight. Especially Abby. I mean, she was in such bad condition. And we just whooped her and then should have drowned her. Let Abby go. So now we got to figure out, is Ellie going to die? Because that had to have been the final boss. Like, this has to be the end of the game. Oh my god. She lost two fingers. Hands look like E.T. <laughs> You're right. She can't play guitar anymore. Unless she tries to play with, like, the nubs of her fingers or something. But, like, what else is there left to do now? Like, we, we saw it. She's gone. Unless she came back and... Do you think she came back and killed Dina or something like that? Wait. Where's Dina? She left, didn't she? She moved out and took the kid. She's in here. Dina just left. That's what it looks like. You can't play. kind of emotional like for all the weird reasons let's say there's no way they're just gonna hop right into the credits right I wish Joel's role in this game would have been a little bigger. Hey. What are you drinking? I mean, this, that really kind of got me just now. Oh, uh, those people that came through last week. Oh. A little embarrassed as to what I had to trade to get it, but it's not bad. I 
I had Seth under control. Yeah, I know. And you need to stop harassing Jesse about my patrols. Dina, is she your girlfriend? No. <laughs> no, she, that was just one kiss. It doesn't mean anything. She just, I don't know why she did that. But you do like her. idea what that girl's intentions are, but, but I do know that she would be lucky to have you. Nice little, I guess, father-daughter type moment here. You're such an asshole. I'm Man, not trying to... I was supposed to die in that hospital. My life would have fucking mattered. Your life still matters. Quit being but you so took aggressive. That from me. I mean, oh my gosh, Ellie. Being ridiculous <laughs> at this point. If somehow the Lord gave me a second chance at that moment. I would do it all over again. Yeah. I mean, does Ellie ever forgive him? I just... I don't think I can ever forgive you for that. Okay, cool. <laughs> Answered my question for me. Thanks. But I would like to try. I like that. that's them trying to fix their relationship he's trying to cry It is a long fucking game. I'm not going to give it a 3 out of 10. Right now, I originally was at like an 8.5. This ending is disappointing enough that I'm giving it a very solid 7.5. So far. But I guess this is the end of the game. It certainly looks like this is the end of the game. Like, this is, if this is really how it's gonna end, this is a very sour taste in my mouth, because, like, even though I didn't like Dina that much, the relationship between Dina and Ellie was so important throughout the whole game, and for them to just kind of cut that off now, that seems a little inappropriate, because Dina had so much to do with this story, and, like, for her to just up and abandon Ellie isn't exactly the greatest thing either. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm not exactly thrilled with the way that Ellie just left Dina. That's the end of the game? Are you serious? 
Okay. So let's let's just vent about it. So my problems with the game. So if if we're talking gameplay, the gameplay was actually amazing. Like the game felt very good to play. It was really good. I really liked it. But oh my gosh. The ending. What I mean, what ending is that? It's like there was so much conviction from Ellie to just go and kill Abby, but not because she wanted it, just she wanted to do it for Tommy, not for any other reason. But like, to then just have Dina vanish the way she did at the end, I mean, that's just such a horrible way to end the story. I mean, there's, like, no good way to end that. I mean, like, I know I'm just kind of rambling at this point, but they could have done so much more to expand on that ending. They could have explained something better. I mean, come on. I'll, I'll make sure to show my cat. I want to watch these credits for a moment because I want to see if they're going to do some sort of post credit scene. I mean, I really did not like the ending of that game. I really did not like the ending of that game. I, everything leading up to it was really pretty good. I think the best part of the game was the equivalent of, like, the first four streams that I did of this game. And then everything past that... is a little... Well, everything past it, it started to go downhill. So, like... Fuck it, I'm getting a copy of paint out here. Okay, so, like... Let me see if I can add this in here. Uh, let's see, add source. Um, window capture, okay. okay, so like, let me just draw this out for you guys, because I think you guys will be able to appreciate this. So like, here's our graph that we have here. If this is how, if, okay, so if this axis is the good side, so like, we're drawing how good the game is on a scale of like, zero to 10. And then this right here, is the duration of the game. So this is the story progress, right? I would say everything up till about the fourth stream, it goes like very solidly up to an eight and a half. Actually, no, that's not really the right way to describe it. Whoops. There we go. It like is a very solid eight and a half right here up until about four hours in and then like whenever you started playing as abby it went very briefly up and then it started to like very slowly go down and i would call this an eight and a half right here right and then i would call this point right here like a very solid six right so like if we're gonna color coat this this is pretty good and then it starts to kind of dive. And then it gets to be like into the yellow territory where like it starts to get crazy, right? So we're going down. Down, down, down. And I would say that we're at like... I would say that maybe we go back up a little bit. And at the moment where we start to go back into the green right here, this is probably stream number eight down here. And this is where like we just got back to the ending of the game. Uh, where, um, where we were playing as, uh, Ellie again, where we were on the farm. Because that was a great way, that would have been a great way to end the game. Just end the game there by showing what her life is like now. And then, they decide to take a very sharp turn down by letting you continue to play as Ellie, and then go down, and then you don't kill Abby, you make it all the way back home, there's nothing to go off of. Like, with Dina just vanishing. And yeah, I mean, Dina vanishes. Like, that takes it all the way down to here for me. Like, if this is this stream today, this is, I would say, like a four. 
I would give this like an average rating of a 7 out of 10. But that's like a really tough 7 out of 10 for me because so much of the game was good. It really was. Like, gameplay, phenomenal. Everything about the story leading up till about here was really good. Let's call this like the seventh stream I did. But that ending really killed it for me. I, I'm i just not a fan of the way that ending worked. I, I don't get it. I just realized this was partially blocking my face. Well, let's move this here. I mean, I'm, I'm just really disappointed with that. And like, I really wanted to enjoy this game. And I mean, I did. I, whoops. I thoroughly enjoyed this game. But that ending killed it. All right, that's enough of that shit. Remove that scene. Anyway, I might start reviewing games like that from now on, where I just draw a graph of how I feel about it from beginning to end. <laughs> it's actually a great way to review a game, though, for real. I'm actually going to save this, and I might post this on Twitter or something. Uh, save this as a JPEG, and... Uh, We'll just call this um, the last of us part two review in a nut. If it was a Zelda game, I could rate each. Yeah, I mean you're right. A sincere thanks to all of the dogs to Bruce. For his instrumental role in the development of Last of Us 2 and his years of contribution to all the Naughty Dog successes. And I guess that's kind of cool. Ugh. Abby is played by Laura Bailey. Let me look up Laura Bailey. It's like, I need to get an image of who this is. Well, I mean, Laura Bailey looks nothing like Abby. <laughs> she did a good job. I mean, she's pretty, but she looks nothing like Abby. She just, I can tell that she pretty much just did the voice exclusively. Maybe she did the mocap and they just changed her model. Man, what a sour note to end that on. Alright, I wanna I I know Gorilla gave it like a very solid like three out of ten. Chase, what do you give this game? Because I uh I, it just wasn't... That was not a good ending for me. Six out of ten. Yeah, I mean, I would say that after the ending going the way it did, I have to agree, a very solid six out of ten. I rated it a 7, I might go ahead and change my rating to a 6. Ugh, well, that, that that video just got a whole lot more interesting because I when I was writing the script for the, the review that I'm going to do of this game, you know, I actually have like a lot of really positive things to say about it, but now I've got reason to like complain a little bit about it. Actually, almost a lot of it about it because the ending just was not good. I, I mean, that just was not a great way to end the story. Like, it, it leaves me with a, a sour taste in my mouth. It's just like, they couldn't have brought Ellie home to Dina, and then Dina gets mad but then just forgives her? Like, what happened to Tommy? Where is everybody? Like, I swear, if they do a Last of Us Part 3, I'm actually gonna be very annoyed. And I probably won't buy it. Not because this game 
wasn't good, but just the way they ended it almost feels like they're wanting to do a sequel. And it's like, if they even dare do a DLC, I'm going to be so annoyed at them. I'll play it. I'll buy it and I'll play it. But I'll be annoyed about it. Actually, I have to wonder. Um, the Last of Us uh, Part. See if they're going to do a Part 3. Oh god, apparently there actually is talks of A Last of Us Part 3. to hear Ellie sing. Wayfaring stranger. There's an article from Venture Beat called Why the Story of the Last of Us Part 2 is Maddening and Fulfilling. Spoilers. There is no sickness, no toil, nor danger in that bright land. I'm trying to figure out if there's anything that would suggest Yes, the third part is really gonna happen. I'm going there to see my mother. She said she'd meet me when I come. I'm just a going over Jordan. I'm just a So apparently there was an argument that they actually weren't going to kill off Joel and Joel was going to be the side character in this game. I know dark clouds will gather around me. I know my way is rough and steep. But beauteous fields lie just before so the, the second game is about what revenge you would exact as someone you loved was taken away. That was apparently the theme they were going for. I don't think they hit the mark on it. I'm going there to see my I think I ended up liking Abby more than Ellie by the end of it. I'm going there no more to roam. I'm just a going over Jordan. I'm just a going over home. I, uh, I mean, I think a part three is probably I'll inevitable. Soon be free. Hey. From earthly trial. He can't sing that great. This body red. Whatever. In the old churchyard. I'll drop this cross of self denial and go sing in home to God. I. <sighs> So it's interesting because this article I'm reading suggests that yeah, there's there's a good chance that a third one could be developed at some point. But it's also comparing it to the likes of Red Dead Redemption 2 and God of War, which like the production quality is probably along the same realm as Red Dead 2 and God of War. But I think the story of Red Dead 2 and God of War both far, far overreach that of this game. Um, and, and they were trying, I think they were trying to be in some ways too political with this game. Um, in the in the inclusion of 
of Dina basically becoming Abby's wife. Not that it's so bad to have, like, a lesbian as your main character. There's really nothing wrong with that. But it feels like a forced statement that I don't think they should have tried to, to make. And I think that was their first stumble. And then they just kind of fell forward from that. And I don't know. I mean, I don't think that would really change at all if for some reason Ellie was to have started as out as a straight character, I don't think that would have made the ending any better, obviously, because the ending was just screwed as it was. New game plus unlocked. Well, I'm never playing this game again. Um, play through the game again with all the upgrades and equipment obtained from previous, play previous playthrough. What I had to do. Well, we did it, boys. I mean... It's cool. This this was a very well produced game in a lot of ways, but still frustrating in all of the the right and wrong ways. Tell you what, I'm gonna end the stream very shortly, but I'm gonna go ahead and do something real quick. Um, let's see. Uh, let's see. Let's go back to VCam. Go back to the original. Oops. Hey, there we go. Now it's just me. Hi, everyone. Um, okay. Let me go ahead and grab my cat. Alright, boys. Here he is. This is Calvin. He's a pretty large boy. Let me see if I can lower the camera just a smidge here. I know, Calvin. Kitty kitty. He's very fat. He's a pretty good boy, though. He's purring pretty loud. He's a good boy. He looks a little grumpy, but he's a good boy. And he wants to claw me, so I'm going to put him down. All right, guys. <clears throat> well, that being said, thank you guys so much for, for making it out to the stream. I know that that was kind of a sour way of ending things. Um, but next stream, we'll figure out something else that we can play. We are going to return to Persona 5 at some point, just not for a little while, I don't think. Not because I don't want to play it, but I just want to like expand and do something else. So. Anyway, I'll, I'll make a post about it in Discord. But anyway, yep, thank you guys for coming out, and we'll catch you guys next stream. So, see you guys.